Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Eternity Chain ERN has been doing insane over the last few days and here we are to do a technical analysis and price prediction over this coin. Before we begin, do not forget to join our monthly subscription, Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto. You do not have to pay upfront right now, Patreon has a new system and of course you can join whatever tire you like. Thank you so much for watching, have a fantastic day. Let's go right now with ERN against USDT. So what we are going to do with the RN, it is we are going to draw a trend-based Fibonacci extension. You know that I love Fibonacci numbers and of course right here onto this one we are going to draw a trend-based Fibonacci extension because we have a clear double bottom pattern and I always want for the viewers to tell what is happening and why did we find the buying pressure instead of just doing a technical analysis and price prediction. So you're going to see here we have three points. One, the neckline and the second bottom. This is why we call it a double bottom. Two bottoms and the neckline. Now, what is the case and why did we pump so much? Because we closed above the neckline in the daily frame and we found a buying pressure around here. Around the neckline you can see that we just found the buying pressure, but the best part about the trend-based Fibonacci extension it is that it is showing us this neckline. I am connecting the first bottom to the high and back to the bottom. And you can see that this is the neckline right here. Look at that, 0.786 Fibonacci retracement, the 2.642. And from there we found the buying pressure going all the way, breaking the 3.19 and now the next target is the 5.43. Can it go there? Unfortunately, the case is that we do not have only the 5.43, right? We have one more resistance level sitting at around 4.23. The thing right here is that we need to close above in the daily frame above the 3.19, okay? If we close above the 3.19, then it is good. As you can see, we already found the 4.22 as a resistance level. It was previously into the 24th January 2022. You can see that our support level and then we collapsed with the Bitcoin crash. Of course, right here, we have gone insane and we went all the way up to the 4.23 again. But can we go now even, even higher? The thing that we need to do, as we talked about, to close above the 3.19. I would prefer to close above in the daily frame, but in the 4-hour frame it is also good. But you can see that we already closed above and we approached the 4.23. Now, if we go to the technical analysis, we can see that we are having a crazily high risk. I am expecting a correction coming out of eternity chain. And this is why I want you to be careful. Because right here, I think that this is a top and we are going to retest the 3.19 along with the 2.65. Now, what's the case right here? If we go back down to the 2.65, what we need to do in order to get higher, it is to hold this support line. Eventually, if we can hold this support line, then we will be going even, even higher. For example, if we go down here, and hold it, then it can explode towards the 5.44. However, if we are going to lose after the 2.654, then we are going to drop all the way down to the 2.30 around there and even further down to the 2 USDT. Yeah, we are talking about a huge correction of more than 40%. Can it happen? Of course it can. For the time being though, I want you to be careful because we are going to go and correct. There is a slight chance that if we close above the 4.23, we are going all the way up. Okay, but we are having a huge, crazily huge risk. But I'm giving this chance in order for you to know. If we close above the 4.23, we are going all the way to the 5.43. The exact price targets always from Mind Your Crypto. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription, Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto as well. Thank you so much for watching, have a fantastic day, and see you soon. Bye.